Back to Ferguson. He's going to shoot it in traffic and scores! An exciting new beginning for the Alberta Junior Hockey League in 21-22. Welcome to the AJHL Black Falls Bulldogs. When the Calgary Mustangs went on hiatus in 2019, the franchise was then purchased by local businessman Doug Quinn and relocated, which meant building from the ground up for he and co-owner Jody. Building a, a brand and, and you know, hiring people and um, yeah, just dealing with all the things behind the scene, it's been a lot of work. Having to put those uh, different areas from retail to ticketing, to sponsorship packages, um, being part of the very start and, and getting our team to put together. The winner in overtime! And the final piece, the $20 million expansion of the Black Falls Multiplex into the 1400 seat Eagle Builders Center. Once I saw the original plan, then it was, okay, I wanna be a part of this. Finally play that, that home opener, like it's a, an amazing facility. And the first game here in the Eagle Building Center goes to the Bulldogs. And from the league's newest team to their home opener opponent. Well, that's a big goal for the Calgary Canucks. The Calgary Canucks joined the seven-team AJHL in the 1971-72 season. For one, is just the longevity uh, to be able to play in one city for 50 years. And I think there's a huge sense of pride. I think you you come to the Ken Baraka Arena, you know, you see the history on the walls. Uh, it's just a testament to the people that were running it back then, the, the Ken Brackos, the Don Phelps, the, and the guys that uh, got the organization off the ground. And then uh, the highlight is uh, winning a national championship. Ken McClure shoots again, deflected, they score! The a franchise that has won a modern day record nine league titles, including making the playoffs for 34 consecutive years, from expansion right up until the 2005 06 season. Kyle Burton, the goal machine! This has been my AJHL story. We'll catch you tomorrow at the Eagle Builder Center.